How's it going, everybody? Welcome back. And some of you guys have been asking, is there a completely free VPN for PC? Now, the answer is yes. And I do have a recommendation for you guys for a really good free VPN that you could use. It's Proton VPN. And if you're looking for an upgrade to a premium VPN, I also have three suggestions that you can use the top three VPNs. Of course, if you guys are interested in any of the VPNs mentioned today, you'll find links to pricing and discounts in the description down below if you'd like to save some cash on the long-term subscriptions of these VPNs, and you'll also find full reviews. Now, just one thing that I do need to point out to you guys is that when it comes to free VPNs, you're going to be the one that's paying for it with your data instead of your money. Now, you know, with a free VPN like Proton VPN, it does have a no logs policy and there are independent audit reports uh, conducted, of course, over the network and privacy policy of Proton VPN to show that they do uphold their privacy policy. It's a pretty safe VPN to use. You can be sure that Proton VPN won't be selling your data to third parties uh, in order to, you know, for advertising purposes. Uh, you should just understand that there are limitations that come with uh, free VPNs, such as limited servers. The servers that are going to be available to free users are going to be super congested. And as you can tell, some of them are just, you know, under maintenance. Um, it's just, you know, it's a, it's a rough time for free servers. You're not really going to get the best speeds. But a free VPN is just supposed to be there really to secure your network if you're using public Wi-Fi or something like that. You're not going to be able to use them for peer-to-peer -peer activities. You're not going to be able to um, unblock streaming services or get the best speeds for your downloads, even if it's just not torrenting. But, you know, as far as Proton VPN, at least they don't cap your bandwidth, so you can use the Proton VPN free servers as much as you'd like, okay? It's a pretty reliable VPN, and you still get the kill switch feature even with the uh, free version of Proton VPN, which is pretty nice. And you get split tunneling, even if you're just a free user, and you get the custom DNS. So it's a pretty good VPN um, as far as uh, a free VPN. But if you're looking to, of course, unblock streaming services, download torrents, and just have a much more reliable, of course, if you just want to upgrade from the regular version of Proton VPN, the, um, the free version, excuse me, to the premium version, this is where I'd tell you, hey, you know, there are better VPNs out there, such as with similar prices and even cheaper, such as NordVPN and Surfshark. And if you're looking for, in my opinion, my the best of the best is ExpressVPN. It's as much of a plug and play VPN as it gets. But with free VPNs, you really need to be careful because, you know, free VPNs will sell your data to third parties for advertising purposes. It isn't unusual to find companies using deceptive practices when trying to market and grow their brands. One niche where this is very rife is in the VPN industry. And when it comes to free VPNs, there are plenty of free VPNs that lure in users in order to get their data. Um, it was recently revealed that contrary to claims on their websites, 26 of the 117 most popular VPN services log user data, despite touting contrary claims in their marketing. That revelation will seem tame compared to findings on how free VPNs operate. Many openly and brazenly share and sell user data. So you really should just keep an eye out for these VPNs uh, that claim to be free. When it's free, it's probably you are the product instead of uh, the money that you're offering, that you're not offering, rather, in this case, since it's a free service. So you should really be careful what you use when it comes to free VPNs. This will be my best recommendation as a free VPN. Um, there's also Atlas VPN is also a pretty good option. Uh, they have a free version, but they do have capped bandwidth. But if you're looking for a premium VPN, these will be the best, um, of course, if you're willing to invest in a VPN. If you're looking for a good VPN, definitely go for one of these. ExpressVPN will be the premium option. NordVPN is a very well-rounded option that focuses on performance, whereas ExpressVPN focuses on privacy and anonymity. And Surfshark will be the best budget option that gets the job done at the cheapest possible cost. Again, you'll find the full reviews if you'd like to learn more about them down below in the top three VPNs video. Also link a Proton VPN review if you're interested in Proton VPN. And you also find links to pricing discounts. I've managed to get you guys some discounts if you want to uh, save a little bit more cash on the long-term plan. 
lands of these VPNs. Besides that, comment below if you have any questions. I'll be happy to answer all of them. Like and subscribe if you'd like to support the channel and stay up to date with everything VPNs and cybersecurity. Thank you guys very much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Have a wonderful day.